Hopefully, this time. What the fuck? What the hell is it doing? Alright, you know, fine. Is it, is it working now? Oh, there we go. Right, I'm gonna have to reinstall GeForce Experience again because it did that bloody thing where it decided to start and then immediately crash out. But, yes. Appears to be working for now. I, uh, I have the little. You can't see it on the video up there, but up here there's a little R symbol which shows that uh, it is working. So, here we are back again with the Vixen's Vanquishers. And, uh. No, uh, no special points for guessing why uh, I have named it. Vixen waits a year. Obviously, I think I'm preempting a lot of questions regarding um, the MechWarrior Five stuff. To be honest, that's what I'm expecting. Uh, well, you know what, Squire was a unique character. Let's let's dump him in there. Apparently, uh, Justin Allard thought he was a he was a real, real go-getter. So let's uh, let's drop with him here in this first one. So, uh, thanks, uh, Master One Five Six One Six. Thanks for letting me know. So yeah, it, it, I'll just have to reinstall uh, GeForce after this stream as well. It's um, it seems to be an issue that kicks off once once the YouTube. Um, streaming thing decides to shit the bed, it eventually catches up and starts affecting the Twitch one, so... It seems to have been a pattern, so... So, uh, just a, a quick uh, uninstall and reinstall of uh, GeForce experience will fix that particular problem. So yeah, so if everyone who watches this on uh, in in YouTube land, we've had a, a good week so far. Whenever you get around to watching this, as far as I'm aware, Thursdays won't change when they uh, when they come around during the week. You know, unless there's some kind of massive upheaval in society worldwide. Go there, do this, shoot that, kill right, everybody. The sooner we get this mission done, the sooner we okay, can vacate uh... this freaking jungle. So I have to have my uh, headphones off because I have to keep an ear out. Oh, what's this? Unicorn Wars Epic News. I got five ten day kit. Oh, that's that's fucking sweet. Oh, little kittens. That's awesome, Unicorn no Wars. On my way. Picked up a blip. That's uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Last time I was in a room full of kittens, they, they just looked absolutely adorable. They're all the same colour as well, they were the exact same like, fur pattern as, as their mother. Yeah, <laughs> Supreme Vols for Kittens. Yeah, that's that's sweet, that's awesome. It's always nice to, uh, to have that little, little bit of joy in your life. Right, so we've got some vehicles, a couple of mechs. Alright, we've got our vehicle and three mechs. Ooh, seems like there's seems like there's more than that. What's going on? What's up, boss? Meanwhile, we've got Otter Hound up here. I'm lucky I got two that look like my older male cat Samson, the dad. That's Sly Puss. Oh, sweet. Affirmative light on this stop the fires. Oh, flame of crit. I think That's I the main reason you're even on the field, mate. It's the main reason you're on the field, mate. It's Waiting for, for you. It's for your flamers, isn't it? Ah, oh. hunchbacks never aye, aye. never get into the party early. Prepping for jump. Yes, unlike Sooty and Heavy, yeah, unfortunately those two can't have kittens because they we got them and they were already. Engaging Ill. target. Oof. Headshot with an AC-10. Holy crap! Oh, Enemy down. that's salvage. Commander. Oh yeah. All right, all right, Squire. All right, Squire, you doing? Where you going over there, mate? Who's off to save Alexander? You are. You are, master. 
You gonna you gonna save Alexander Madeira? What's up, boss? Problem, the problem with that name for him is I always it just always makes me think of Madeira cake. Holiday. And I like Madeira cakes. Right. Where are the rest of the enemy? Will they be approaching from yonder hill? Aye. No, oh, aye. Here comes another. Oh, it's another fire starter. Slaps the old Griffin there. Only bad thing, Mama Cat has them behind a dresser in my carriage and I can't get them easily. I want to play with them very badly. Oh. Ah, uh, you will. You'll get there eventually. Oh my god. What the fuck? How many mechs are there in this one? Alright, safety. What, what kind of a shot have you got? Uh, well, that's, that's a silly question, isn't it? Because apparently you've, you've got... You have got... Uh, what do they know as? No shot. Firing jump jet. Adam Grayson, last week flashpoint mission felt like you were f you were fighting the class. <laughs> yeah, maybe I was, maybe I was. Confirmed. I mean, at least he's extra bit beat up, so you know, they're not going to take many hits to kill. Just fat son. A whole lance of mechs, and by the looks of it, a lance of vehicles, which is uh, you. a little bit uh, intimidating. I'm not going to lie. On my way. Plus, uh, the main, my main character, me, essentially, is out for another month and a bit after that um, experience. Oh, there goes the uh, fire start. That's you put out to pasture. Hassle removed. Standing by. Apparently, if she just walks over there, Copy that. she's got an angle on the uh, on the, the striker. Cool strike a lot. Oh, except the AC-10 decided to go f on a fucking mission. Uh, it decided to go visit that mountain top over there. Yes, commander. That was a bit of a weird one. Lift it off. All right, squire. It's up to you, mate. Get your first kill. It's a vehicle. It's it's not the most impressive of targets, but I, I believe in you. Oh, he's missed a few. Oh, he, oh, he got it though. Oh, well done, Squire. You've been bloodied. Vehicle trashed. You got your first kill. You've taken lives. Well done, Squire. You're a man now. Uh, minimal damage on that hit. Oh, now we've got to put it up into a three max. Jesus. All right, he's he's not getting involved. I'm just gonna have to like pivot round and engage these three. I know he's he's got some balls. Uh, not not enough balls to yes, go right commander. to the top of the hill, like, but you know, balls nonetheless. If I can jump a little bit further, I'm in. Hi, copy. Hey, Pincer, how you doing? Oh, also, my mother got back from a British Isles cruise and got me a fancy, uh, a fancy hat, a fancy hat <laughs> uh, from England. Oh, fancy hat? Or oh, is it like, is it a pork pie? Pork pie hat. Taking the shot. Like, uh, like the one. Um, What's his name? I forget his fucking name now. Breaking Bad. I forget his name. Walter White. Like the one Walter White wears. Good to go. Yeah, you one of them. Moving out. So you can walk around going, I am the one who knocks. Indubitably, good sir. Uh, you know what? We'll just go with the AC-20. There we go. I don't think like we need to generate extra heat with those uh, medium lasers. Commander. We'll go. Exactly are we up against over there? Is it just like a, a quartet of fire starters? It is another fire starter. Is there some kind of theme going on here? 
Go for the headshot, you're out one. Alright, we'll blue blue's armor. It looks like a golfer's hat folding thing from Fenway. Oh right, okay. Um, you know what? My not my hat knowledge is particularly low, to be honest. Don't wear a hat myself. I don't think it fits a guy with long hair, to be honest, wearing a hat. Uh, yeah, well, don't, 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 don't worry, Squire, you're not firing, you're just firing the AC-2s. Oh, you hit with both, look at that. You're on your way to becoming a real man. Oh, Christ, it wasn't a fire starter, it was a locust. I'm, 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 I'm tearing up. No, whiff. Okay. Oh. Hang uh, on. Two enter? medium mechs in this lance. On my way. Now I'm, uh... Huh. Okay, you get me a little bit worried here now, can you? not going to be doing something to me, though. I'm not really going to like, are you now? Let's try it. No! Oh, right leg, right cells are... No destruction, though. He's going to have a... He's going to have a whoopsie, though. Sensor effect. I'm slowly liquefying here. It was 35 Celsius plus today, probably up to 40 in the sun. Ugh. Ooh, I do not envy that one on you, man. Oh, it's one of those hats, right? It's a bit like a kind of. Um, Standing by. Another one you mean now. A bit like a flat cap. No problem, boss. I got this. No problem, boss. I got this. Uh, just uh, jumping over here. Alright, so there's a wool V and some other medium mech over there. We're going to continue to focus on fire. Firing all the weapons. Fire stuff to make sure he's wet. Hot damn. Let's do this. At least the humidity's Hot dropped out so that I can take off gills now. <laughs> Awaiting orders. What, you don't want to be the creature of the Black Lagoon? It came from Uranus. Target's taken a critical hit. Unicorn well, secretly I wanted a bowler a bowler hat and a huge Churchill cigar going around telling the yelling Bloody rubbish! Bloody rubbish, I tell you. Orders? Where's my scotch? Yeah, it'd be like that. Be heavily inebriated and tell Hitler where to shove it. You bloody Nazis! I'll make them if there's somebody about that, you say Nazis instead of Nazis. I'll tell you what, we'd better check my targeting system. Oh, it's a Jenna. What the fuck is the Jenna doing? It's fresh! And it immediately runs in for a melee attack. Wow. Did... I really kinda hope he. Uh, not PG, HPS do a patch soon that will. Address this bizarre activity of the AI now that they introduced with the Urban Warfare update. With just light mechs, just all of a sudden deciding that it's their chosen duty to just headbutt everything in sight. It's fucking weird. This is not the use of a light mech at all. Step one, wander blithely into enemy fire. Step two, step three, profit. I mean, that, that's basically the way that it, it's it's acting. Reporting minimal damage. Reporting minimal damage, Commander. Yes, Commander. Oh, yeah, jeez, yeah. Oh, jeez. Minimum damage here, Rick. Time to get up close and poison. Giving him everything I've got. Oh, blast. Don't want him getting up, shooting me. Shooting my Target hunch. Alright, so it just leaves the old squire. Hey, you doing, squire? <laughs> hey, you doing, mate? You doing alright, mate? Little squire. Yeah, hey, shoot you there, mate. Shoot you in the right arm. Orders. And the otter hound. He generates heat for, for, for money. 
Is anyone know is, is that new Overwatch character going out yet? Because I'm interested in playing. Mainly so I can just go, hey, Veronica Guber, the Dutch character they added, shit. Scored a critical hit. Just to wind them up. Don't even know if Frum's in the chat. Is he in the chat? No, he's not in the chat. He's at work. Veronica sat there with a big smile on his face anyway because it's the last day of work and he's off for three weeks. Ooh, he's going to be a happy bouncy bunny. Yeah, Commander. Wow, they, they just they love they love getting close to this hunchback. I... No, he doesn't have clogs. That was the first thing Goober and Frontier asked you know, was. That that is that is the first thing that they asked. And no, Blizzard went and let everybody down by not having a floating, gravity manipulating, clog wearing bad guy, which I think was a massive lost opportunity. I think Goober and Furrika are the same commander. opinion, to be honest. Standing by. Whatever, what everyone needs in, in their game these days is a, is a villain who wears clogs. Roger that. Does he fly by windmill? No, this is another missed opportunity, Unicorn Wallace. There's so many things they could have done. I mean, he could have had the ability to, you uh. know, open the dikes and just flood the map and stuff like that, but he didn't. Ah, uh, he's some kind of astrophysicist yeah. who went mental after he for? sort of created a micro black hole that, you know, made him go mad or some shit. I don't know. It's all it's all very silly. Very silly. Okay, so he goes to there apparently. Boycott and lies, yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't want to get into two boycotts. I'm already in I'm already in in one, so you know. We all know what's happened with MechWarrior 5. Got something after you want last done? week. Locked on, all weapons. What's it still uh, Graviton for this? <laughs> it's it's Graviton Man, isn't it? Good. Stereotype of the Dutch doing mad with scientific power shame. It, yeah, it could have been great. You know, it could have been the perfect um, perfect scenario there, but no. They're, they're not going for the, the, you know, smallest common denominator, lowest common denominator there, and just going for the for the evil One Dutchman with clogs. It's just, yeah, real shame. Oh yeah, I have to, like, you know, I have to grab Roger. stuff, that's right. Yeah. I'm supposed to be here to recover Position confirmed. parts or some shit, but... Yeah, I know. I did grab, grab the thing. I'm going to hop up and get the other part. Aye, aye. It's rather... Pretty map, actually. I don't think I've been on this version for a really long time before. The asset has been secured. And the asset has retrieval. been secured, Commander. That's just a race for everyone to get to the target. Confirmed. The winner of that race is okay. Squire. Here we go. I bet he's white too, and a male. Why not a lady of color that has questionable sex behavior? <laughs> uh. Oh, I can imagine if they went that route. I bet they even look alike. What's, what's this? What's this pincer? Oh, you know what? Actually, um, he doesn't have hair. He's bald. Um, but he does wear this like special outfit that he's got for controlling his powers. But there's definitely a graviton man type influence. Definitely a. a I would, I would put money on it that the uh, that the guy who created the character uh, was was going for that kind of um, style. I don't, I've not even watched the the public test stuff to actually to see how he plays. I don't, he, he might play like shit for all I know. <laughs> Why not a robot clone of Glass? No color, and that's an atheist. <laughs> Papa Slumps could be worse. Uh, could play football for FCB or be Belgian. <laughs> oh, hey, Papa Slump. Alright, let's sell those off. Look at that. Look how profitable that mission was. We got two whole mechs out of it. Made on top of the contract monies and didn't have to pay any, any repair costs. So over three million again. This is great. This is amazeballs. Interdiction. Uh, so like convoy stuff. 
get it like that around here, isn't it? It's not particularly. It's like, <sighs> I could do an assassination, I suppose. It's worth 381,000. One salvage. One salvage. Is that all I'm going to get from this? Fucking hell. Even if I want two. Two, two choice of salvage out of it with a 10 max for my answer. Ooh, 34,000. This is this is still my beating heart. Uh, Alright, fine. We'll do that just for the two choice. Just in case the other guy, uh, the, the target, is actually worth going after. <laughs> you go to the Tyrus with more work than a coffee at it at Go Game Convention. Yeah. Yeah, well, we, we've all got our, uh, our finger on the pulse of what's needed in today's uh, society, right? <clears throat> Alright, I'm not going to lie, Papa Slum. I'm going to... I have a go at trying to pronounce that word, and it's going to be hilarious. But just, just for everyone watching, it's spelled Z-D-R-A-V-S-T-V-U-Y-T-E. Right, so, if I have a, if I have a look at this... Look at this word. Command Actually, am I? Initiated. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If I try and pronounce this word, and, I, and even if I'm remotely successful, am I going to say something highly offensive to Russian players? Well, this or highly offensive to anybody at this rate? I got to be careful. You know, I've got, I've got like a Y list. Um, fucking. Okay, right. Okay, I'm going to bring it closer. So it's, uh. Fucking hell, okay, uh... Zradsvitzo... Uh, no, fuck it, I... No, I'd have to get a phonetic... F fucking... Uh... Breakdown of that. Moving to position. And that's not, that's not knocking, way. uh... That's not knocking Russian or anything, because Russian actually sounds quite cool. Uh, as, uh, as far as languages go, you know. For jump. Aye, aye. More woke than post -war World War II Russian government using POWs and human sleep tests. Moving oh, that's that's opened my eyes on that one, Unicorn Wallace. Position confirmed. I've got something. Go in, <laughs> It means hello, Jesus. Christ. There's a mech over there. There's a mech over there! Ready to get it on. There's enemy mechs everywhere. What have we got? got a sensor lock. Well, of course, it's not going to be threatening, is it? I'm on a, I'm on a one skull mission, but. Receiving you. Oh, yeah. Drumpf up in here. Oh, yeah. Lifting up. Jump over here and force Ever seen, uh, uh, you have German selected in your voice module at Chris Grant? <laughs> Do I? Well, I mean, I can speak a, a tiny bit. Scored a critical hit. Uh, what was this? Ever seen someone, uh, be awake for 14 days? I, I think you, you die after a certain point because your body needs sleep. I think that there is a point where you, your, your body just collapses because it just cannot function that long without any kind of sleep. Location I know that confirmed. much. Well, apparently, I hit the mech behind with a stray shot, so Order? that's good. You know, if I'm going over, I may as well fucking sprint it just to get the extra evasion. I know some people swear off evasion. I still find it works. Oh yeah, well, th there's also the madness that's brought on by you know, being awake for so long without sleep. Yeah, it's, that, that goes without saying. But yeah, if you if you were to purposely keep yourself awake for um, X number of days, you would die. no different than when you get these like crazy fucking streamers who just stay on for pff, fucking 
days on end and then they die and be, and it becomes a news story and the, the obvious thing is like well, of course he died he just sat there and played a computer game for way too fucking long I knew it was going to injure it. Oh, I've got to travel to New Planet after this mission now. Got something you want done? God damn it. Roger. Where is this striker anyway? Give them everything you've got. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Uh, well. receiving you. Sorry, but you just fucking wounded the pilot. You're getting everything. There you go. I hope we can salvage that. Panzer Magic used to sleep on his streams. I, that's Commander? unhealthy. I, I guess say that as much as the, the, there are games that I really love. And I, I would love to stream them and stuff, but I wouldn't ever stream a game so long that I have to sleep while being live. Because I'll just go to sleep, you know? Engaging target. It's, not like, it's not like it just vanishes off my pissing hard drive after a, after a set amount of time, is it? Target eliminated. Uh, the, the, honestly, I think there's something wrong with people when they want to do that. It also, if you're that heavily invested financially that, you know, if you're not streaming, you're not making money kind of thing. Firing jump jet. I don't know if it's working for you if you need to be online that fucking long. Coordinates received. I don't know, it's just unhealthy. It's like Position confirmed. kissing Russ's ass over this fucking Macquarie thing. That's unhealthy. There was like three dogs in the garden next to me, uh, next door. And like any dog, they decide to start shouting about, Hey, you a dog? I'm a dog. I'm a dog too. Hey, we're all dogs. We're all dogs in this garden together. On the Isn't move. it great being a dog? Yeah, dogs are great. In the chip. Aren't dogs amazing? Every day, <laughs> my stream house would be awesome. <laughs> Are you a dog? Standing yeah, I'm by. a dog. What type of dog are you? I don't know. Burr. They call me a French bulldog. What's that? I don't know. It's just what I am. I'm a dog. Oh, that's a wolverine. That's okay. Target acquired. Target damaged. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. Good to go. Oof. Pull safety. No shoot. So far away Just and no one's back. Sound an air horn while I sleep for a thousand dollars. Yeah. Well, there used to be a channel on um, YouTube that was called uh, Internet Fails. And um, we used... Me and um, my brother and, uh, and Kitty used to watch that. Uh, because they, they were like 10 minute, 15 minute Firing videos. And it would usually just be like stupid shit that streamers have done. Uh, some of them are wins, like, but that that channel was great because that you got to see hurt. some of the the crazy excesses Commander. that these people who just live on Twitch uh, will, will perform in. for the most trifling amounts of money. It's crazy. That's pretty accurate. <laughs> Discussion dog conversation. It's, it's every dog conversation. Where are you going? Receiving you. We're in the flip. Do you no think problem, you're going, no, mate? I got this. You're not getting away from me, mate. Nah, mate. Apparently, I can only see him with, his L with the LRM5. Sorry, but I, I have to question this. <laughs> Sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Line of sight check here. Or maybe, maybe I. Oh, I'll just let you get away with that. Do you Awaiting orders. Rag him off in you. Confirm. You get people to send you gold. Apparently, if you become a big enough a big enough Twitch streamer, yeah, you, people people will send you their fucking children. They'll donate crazy amounts of money to you. Right here. 
On the one hand, that's kind of cool, I guess, because there are people who, who enjoy your content that much that they're willing to just fork over hundreds of, you know, crazy amount of cash, but I've never asked for money. It's never really occurred to me. But, I don't know, to me it always feels a bit, I don't know, a bit scuzzy. I don't know why. I don't, it probably isn't. It's just Solid it's connection on that one. Waiting for orders. Yeah, I've asked developers in the past for um, review keys, which I've gotten a few of, so I can't complain. I've had some freebies in War Thunder and um, little bits of pieces I've had. Good to go. Um, Jumping. I mean, it's, it, over the years, I've not done too bad out of it. I've never, never asked for money from anybody who's watched, Locked because I, personally, I don't like this kind of stuff doing worthy of asking people for cash, you know? Connection on that one. Oh yeah, I should start selling bath water. That's right, yeah. Yes, command. That's the future. I've just taken a bath. Here, have have my fucking horrendous uh, horrendous bath water. Better yet, I've just had an enema. You can have the enema water. Mm, that's it. Guzzle that shit down. Aye aye. Yeah, it's about as rank as that, really. Target locked. Well, if the intention was to get anything off this Wolverine, that that idea would have gone out of the out of the window a long time ago, with the bath water. Moving to position. I don't ask. I say send tribute. Uh... Target locked. Now I've had that PayPal button on the channel for a long time, but. You know, I never, I've never asked anybody to use it. Ow! That looked like a headshot. That looked like a headshot. Systems are holding. That son of a bitch. Yeah, commander. Oh well, the executioner is in town now. On my way. Here she comes. Du, 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 du. You know what? It's been it's been a shitty couple of weeks since oh, we the recent found out yesterday that Monster Hunter Iceborne on PC has been delayed till January now, which Let's sucks. Because me, Goober, and Frum were really looking forward to that. Successful. It's out in September on console, but I'm not I'm not buying a copy of Monster Hunter World again on PS4 to then buy that. <laughs> Bill strides, falls right to my honor, asking people to send pics of the. Not a bad idea. See how creative people can get, basically, yeah. Let's see, LRM, SRM, ammo. Uh, Alright, yeah, I'll, I'll take a bit of a locust. Ooh, I have a bit of a locust, yeah. Pound half a bacon. Mm-hmm, there we go. Yeah, it's loading up. Anytime now. Yeah, if you want to load it. Yeah, I'm on game. Yep. Looks like we'll have to mosey on out of this part of town. 15 days! Holy shit. I am not asking them to tell others of my greatness. Uh, <laughs> That's up to them. <laughs> Do I have any points to spend? Not on her. Don't give. I don't care about you, herringbone. Waiting for orders. Something I can do. Ah, Squire. Squire, who I like to believe is a is a uh, flat earther of the BattleTech universe, despite the fact that he's uh, in space and can see all the planets around. Still doesn't quite believe it. Uh, navigation. Star map. Oh, I got maps to famous people's uh, homes. Star maps. Star maps available. Get your star maps here. Try and get a peek of Sharon Stone in the nutty. Get your star maps here. That's right, folks. Oh, yeah. Oh, we can go to Bellerophon. Or Detroit. Oof. Still might be hot. All right, D Detroit, Detroit, it is. We're going to go to Detroit, people. We're all going on a holiday. We're going to Detroit. 
Yeah, we're gonna smash it great. Yeah, Detroit is the place I want to be. Hey, oh, the contracts, they're made just for me. Oh, Detroit, Detroit, that's where we want to be. Hey. So, uh, that's the, uh, that's the going to Detroit song. Don't expect there to be a song to go to every planet, especially like, uh, Manjang Dian. Which, I don't know if I can really fit that into any kind of song. Do, 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 do. So... I know some people just like this. I love these little animations. I wish there were more of them. I wish... Is it to do a Kickstarter to raise money so they could add more of these cutscenes? Oh, Darius, you've come to steal my money. Thank you. That's great. Catch fire, Darius. Bye. Oh, there it is, folks. The black pearl that is Detroit. There it is. We've arrived at our destination. Ah, oh, thanks, thanks, uh, Samira. There, you've uh, you've pointed out the obvious. Jump jets, heat sinks. Yeah, yeah, pretty, pretty standard stuff for sale here. Did I need to repair anything in the mech bay? I can't remember if anything went through. Uh, no, we're all good. We're all good on that. Wasn't paying attention. Now we'll look at what's available here at in Detroit. It's a wonderful place. It's the place we want to be. Trap sprung. Uh, what else have we got? Some supply lines. We've got cease and desist. Motherfucker. Destroy base. Mopping up. Uh, contested will. It's always fun. And destroy base. Contested will is 640,000 on a payout for maximum of three whole pieces of salvage. Mm, I don't really have the ranged weaponry to do a mission like that, though. Um, uh, let's see. Trap. Vorsprung. Trap. Uh, sending a message. A lot of base destruction missions on this planet. Capture base, battle, battle, destroyer base, battle, capture base, destroyer base. Like 50 50 there, isn't it? it's a bit crazy. A bit, uh, most of these are going to be kind of boring. We, I don't know if I should try the capture base mission, but I don't really. I've got two mechs with large lasers, I've got one with scouting. Uh, I've got AC2s. I, said, yeah, I could probably do it. I could probably do it. I think he's out of the... She's out of the... Med bay now, isn't she? Yeah, yeah okay. Oh, Christ. Hold on, hold on. I've, there's a delivery at the door. Why, if I'm not falling asleep? Finally got his super star destroyer back. <sighs> so, anyone who's familiar with the tabletop game Star Wars Armada, be aware of the models that are in that. And uh, yeah, they uh, they did a special a, a special model. Look at the, the, you can get the three of them. What a load of shit! Nah, nah. You, you stay up your ass, mate. Oh, there's nothing here. You know what? We're gonna go to a better world. Go find a better world. Better world than Detroit. Ugh, smells. Oh, why is it to just go across? Bellerophon. Mantharaka. The toy. The toy that costs more than the other toy. Do I still play Warframe? Yes, I do. Not a lot, but I, I do still play Warframe. Sacramonte, here we come. Yeah, uh, the box is massive, Ikari. It's it, it's it's huge. Was it pirates ambush the Argo? I'm not liked by the locals. Fine, fuck off. 
take damage when my pilots get injured. Yeah, it, it's it's pretty big. It's on the two-seater couch. It's taking up nearly both seats. That model is going to be effing massive. Um, maybe I, I'm interested to see where my brother's going to put it. I've got all the other models uh, for the game. I just wish they'd make more. They just kind of stopped. Typical FFG, really. Focusing too much on X-Wing Wave 2. I suspect they're going to do a, an Armada uh, version 2 with, uh, like, Clone Wars stuff. So everyone complain about I like the models. So I've got some of the Clone Wars stuff for X-Wing as well. Got the, the two starter sets for that, so... Got me some clone fighters. The Jedi Starfighter and all that. FFG just announced a Marvel card game, and I know I'm going to buy that, even though no one here plays card games, but I, I like it because I like the art on the cards. But it's like a cooperative one. After hearing that Herringbone was involved in an accident, you decide to pick the blue one. Herringbone is injured. Morale is increased by one. What? Why does everyone get increasing? Did everyone want him to get injured? Man, I should have read that. Yeah, card game. What? I didn't say it like a fucking Klingon. Card game! You know, what the hell you know was? Mom, he's misrepresenting me. All right. Let's have a look at these. Let's, let's see if these bad boys are there. Take a look at D's contracts. Eventually, once the 56k modem for Comstar Networks. There we go. Wow, a two two score planet with two two score missions. Raiding party, which is the battle, and letter of mark. Okay, these these are paying a, a little bit more. The battles. Okay, where it gets the Capellans. Oh, Vixen's back in action. Okay. Um, yeah. All right. So, uh, safety. You're in there. Yeah. We, we've we've got to take the A team for this one. Haven't we? Can't bring Squire into this fight. Revenge is a planeswalker best of cold. <laughs> Yes, yes. <laughs> oh god, now everyone's trying to come up with different versions of saying card. Jesus. Jean-Luc Picard game. Quad game. The one with the flat picture. Pain. <laughs> oh, I've heard about that. Gambling is bad. It's not that kind of card game. Unicorn Wallace. It's not like I put 10 quad loose on Spider-Man. No, it's alright, cool. So I know you meant Plane Planeswalker referencing Magic the Gathering. I used to buy the the, the single player Magic the Gathering games that they uh, brought out on Steam, and then they just stopped and went with the free to play model. Holy shit, the surface of this planet is weird. That's not weird. Acquire the location and engage. Let's put a stop to their raid. Why don't we engage them during the raid? That way, the people defending can have support, and we can ambush them. Moving out. Uh, I guess I guess we want to do like so Move order preventative medicine then. Huh? Also, well, great color confirm. scheme choice for my guys. Blue and yellow. <laughs> a great background. Don't worry, we're real. <laughs> we're stealthy. What the fuck? Uh, can they? Hello? Ready to get it on. Why does the Griffin have no choice of movement? Why does it? I have to jump him. Okay, that's strange. Hitting the jump jet. He's hitting the job jets. Ah, I've been got covered with enemy mech already. Oh, piss. Alright, well. well. Confirm. If, I guess if I can get them, basically, to come to me. Aye, aye. By this ridge line, that's good. <clears throat> I, I have played D&D. &D. We also played Pathfinder. Yeah, uh, yeah, Adam Grayson. I, th I believe it's a moon. Well, it's just an airless rock. Could be a planetoid, I suppose. All right, let's get eyes on. What are we looking at? Sensors locked on. Okay, blackjack. Oh, it's a one DB as well. Oh, it's a variant. Uh, with the large lasers. Oof. 
Oh, that's, that has to be a decent upgrade, actually, from the uh, one I've got. Um, right, if I have a sprint around there, it means that she might be able to get the flanking maneuver on a flatjack. I've actually got the... Uh, are you talking about the new Star Trek role-playing game? Uh, you know, because I do have the, the core rulebook for that. I bought a PDF of it because uh, it looked interesting. I'm not like I'm not a massive fan of Star Trek, but I do like some of the stuff in the universe. Pathfinder, if you have to. Ah, oh, we know we know where Unicorn Wallace's loyalties lie. What's up, boss? Fire and jump jet. <laughs> Alright, let's brace here. Let's see, we'll, let's see if they get a little bit closer. Oh no, mate. <laughs> Who spotted him? Light damage, holding firm. Oh, this is bullshit. Good to go. Alright, Otterbotter. Uh, it's time for you to get, uh. Whatever you say. Get your, uh, your beautiful face, uh. Alright, let's go. Because we know there's a blackjack, so we can sense to lock him and find out what he is. He got an LRM launch got released. Lock. Shadowhawk 2D. Okay, so we've got a blackjack and a Shadowhawk to contend with, and possibly something else, we're not sure yet. Alright, okay. Star Trek Academy. i got Generations DSN Starter Trainee Roleplay book, Star Trek Academy. All right. Oh, this must be the original one. I've I've got the new uh, print. Engaging target. Oh, hit, hit, hit. That's good. That's a good chunk of his uh, torso exposure. Standing by. Oh, I'll put something a bit more. Copy that. In her face. Oh, D6 systems were nice. I played a lot of the West End Star Wars uh, game with my brother and his friends. Engaging target. That was a nice D6 system. Yeah, Commander. Lift it off. Lift it off. Yeah, I'm walking here. Yeah, and then lifting it off. Oh, hot blackjack on blackjack. We hit everything except the CT. <laughs> Although he did do the right thing, he ran away. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I am aware that there's uh, Engaging jump jet. there is more than just that. I mean, it'd be weird to think it'd just be the Shadow Hawk and a Blackjack on this mission. There's at least there's got to be at least be a lance, right? Sweet. Right, so I'm got destroyed. That's not good Sword for him. Critical hit. Comes the Shadow Hawk again. Uh, yeah, there's uh, there's the Picard show. Yeah, uh, I know, Grayson. I think they've also got season three. I think of Discovery. Though that that's definitely a um, bit of a contentious series. I know some people some people like don't mind it. I think other people absolutely hate it with a passion. Engaging target. Miss. I, s I clearly saw the effect for it hitting. Oh well. Right, who's this guy? It's a senti. The centurion who's very kind and he didn't shoot me first. Affirmative. If I get the classic cold rulebook, I might try to start a game as a DM. Oh, of uh, Star Trek. Uh, yeah, probably, we probably won't be able to salvage that. I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't put money on salvaging it, you know. Help it. Just like these two for this round, just let it cool off a bit. Focus down the shadow hole now. Engaging. Oh, 
Oh, crit the LRM5, nice. Inflicted some heavy damage. And went into that right torso, that juicy, succulent right torso. Ooh, whiffed. And out of all things that hit, it was the LRM. Even though that was crit, all the other weapons missed. Well, it's just how things go. Okay. It's time to go real nice and close. Yeah. So I like it. Don't want to focus a specific area. No, mate! No, I don't want to have a heat. There we go. Boom! Right torso gone. Right arm gone. That said, it's not the most important torso I want to shadow hold. The left one is more important, but he's lost his missile capability. And one of his lasers. That's pretty good. Now the Centurion. Is a bit worrying for me. That EC10 is nothing to sniff at, especially. Ow, 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 he's fucked up the blackjack. Structures are important. Internal damage. Uh, orders. Picking on my blackjack. Can you pillage stuff in Star Trek? It's like beaming an away team down. <laughs> it's just like man. <laughs> Spurn on. <laughs> Take the women! <laughs> it's like Rigel 7 immediately up, gets invaded by, 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 the, by the party. Coordinates so, dude, I want some hot Rigel bitches. That's not the point. We're supposed to be Star Trek officers. Fuck that! One of the crew members is like just a horny Ferengi. Awaiting orders. It's like, oh yeah, I want someone to rub my lobes. Uh, Adam Grayson, ABC shot their own foot uh, that the show wasn't on normal television going with Hulu. Uh, it, yeah, unfortunately, it's just the case of everything now. TV's going exclusives on everything. Fucking games going exclusives on everything. <sighs> I mean, at this rate, at this rate, just just to uh, just be able to access websites, you're gonna have to buy exclusive internet service providers. IGN now exclusive to Epic. Yeah. Meanwhile, heavy hits, Commander. Uh, you know, meanwhile, Overwatch.com announces an um, exclusivity agreement with uh, with fucking Valve. You know, Pornhub signs multi-year deal with uh, with like Com Comcast or something, so th their website is only carried by their providers. That wasn't, that wasn't the, that wasn't the head. I don't know. The head shot. Engaging oh. target. Well, we exposed them. I mean, it was going to be a hit, I just wanted it to be the, Standing by. I wanted it to be the head. I wanted it to get a head shot. Acknowledge. Oh, CT's open. Yes, Commander. Target confirmed. Oh, there goes there goes the AC-10. Now he's in trouble. Scored a critical hit. <laughs> Press the three buttons. Well, then just beam the cargo into a hold. The women into our quarters and the enemy into space. Game over. <laughs> Set spaces to Good sexy. To exactly. Now, unfortunately, that's what you're going to get with, with trying to GM a tabletop session at first start, isn't it? That's a kill. Mission successful. Yeah, but Stargate sucks. That's the problem, Pinter. Nah, it's, it's Stargate isn't it. The film was great for its time, and the TV series definitely has a lot of campy fun to it. Uh, I did like the series. I keep forgetting the name of it. It was the one that had. Um, I, I just can't brain. Um, fucking Scottish actors from uh, Train Spotting. I want to say Robert something, but uh, it's the one where they got stuck in space, like the other side of the galaxy or something, and they were on a, an unknown ship, and they had to, they were trying, there was like a group of soldiers and some civilians, and they were trying to find a way to get the ship back. Yeah, Continuum, yeah, it could have been that one, Master, yeah. <laughs> Put some velour, is that right? Exactly, yeah, uh, you just, you just run your Star Trek, you your Federation vessel, like. Like it was one of Zap Brannigan's pleasure cruises. 
Ah, uh, it, it wouldn't end well. Everyone would want to be Zap Brannigan. It's okay, we sent wave after wave of our own men. Red shirt after red shirt. Did I have any plus plus plus? I do anyway, so I don't want to sell this blackjack just yet. Or if I do, I need to remember to remove that and the cockpit mod from it. Okay. Just repair everything. Just, just repair everything, Yang. Fix everything. Right. Including the drinks machine. God damn it, Yang. Everyone wants to be a Klingon. Klingons remind me of the clans too much, though, so I, I just want to stay away from them. Uh, no, I don't have a better LRM-10. I've got no spare better medium lasers. Gyro? I was supposed to go in the engine. Oh, I don't definitely have space in the engine. Oh, what's this? I hear a bro. Hello. There's a large package for you, and <laughs> I don't mean that. <laughs> Robert Carlyle, that's his name. Yeah. Oh, it's for me? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. The financial report. Oh, fucking Darius stole my money in one day. Oh, fuck it. Man, he planned that with precision. Thieving bastard. And how is everybody in internet world? Everyone's everyone's pretty good in internet world. So far, we're having a good old laugh. At the moment, we're talking about uh, what it'd be like tabletop playing Star Trek. I just I just said it. It would basically just turn into a thing where everyone would just go to Rigel Seven and just basically beam up hot women and and have a party. Uh, meanwhile, I also said someone would probably play like a horny Ferengi who just wants his lobes rubbed. Oh God. Yeah, I, I've, I've played the uh, RPG, and the phasers are virtually one-shot kill. <laughs> so I got vaporized. It's on the D6 system, yeah. Because that's uh, the one. Unicorn Wallace says he's got, like, the D6 books. No, no, not on the D6. It's, uh, it's much older. This is uh, from the 80s. Oh, wow. Okay. And uh, we had a small Federation ship. We get captured. What's that say? The man. Hey, hey, bro. Hello! That's you. That's me. Stargate Universe, that's it. Thanks, Papa. Yeah, so we have a small ship. We, we, we get captured by the Klingons and put on board this space station. The entire game was to escape to get back to the ship, and then we were supposed to have a small battle with a small scout ship. Just as we're running down the corridor that connects to our ship, I got shot once and insta-killed. <laughs> I literally missed the last half hour of the game. It was I was not impressed. So there you go. That's Star Trek for me. Oh uh, yeah, you, you're right, no man. Yeah, uh, Zap Brannigan would be better than Darius. Yeah, he he'd be the accountant that I think I can trust for the mercenary unit. Zap, how dare you say that about Zap Brannigan? Rubble. You can't say that about the Zapper. Alright, I'm just, I'm just here to destroy enemy units and, and shoot bubble gum and I'm all out of gum. He was having a shower. I couldn't get to the door. Nah, no, it's fine. It's fine. Move order confirmed. On the move. No, no, it was, uh, <laughs> no, I, I just, I just, uh, I just assured everyone that that I hadn't fallen asleep while streaming because we were discussing that earlier. So. Space treasure hunters visiting alien worlds and selling everything. <laughs> hey, the Orions, they buy. Yeah, yeah, they do. They also have sexy green space women. Out. The Prime Director says nothing about Heads making up, physical contact. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Well, I'll tell you, confirm. Darius has got his fucking finger on the pulse of the situation. He knows that there's enemy contacts inbound. Because we just fucking detected them. Oh no, Capellans. Hostile on sensors. Hostile on sensors. Well, well I'm just going to... Oh, Javelin. Okay. Yes, Commander. We'll play a game called Gank the Commando. Is 
since he's out here all on his lonesome. Sweet. Oh, there's there's a lot of cat love going on over here to my right, though. Got a lock. Got a lock. The new single from Alter Hound. I got a lock. I got a lock. I got a lock. Copy that. Capellan Swarm, yeah. Working for Quark, sending people into the wormhole and looking for things on the other side. Yes. Sounds about right. Oh yeah, by the way, bro, uh, Unicorn Wallace uh, apparently is now the uh, the, the proud um, servant of a number of new fluffy kittens. Oh no, yeah, how cool is that? No, you can't sense lock me. That's against the rules. Right, okay. So the commander picked a good spot to hide because it turns out my movement points were shit. They've got a sensor lock on me. Stop it with the sensor locks. Could lay off with the sensor. Oh shit, PPC. Oh, oh shit. Oh, that's a griffin then. Well, you know what that is? That right there is a griffin. Oh, the commander didn't walk too far. That's gonna hold him. Ow. Can stray SRM shots hit my hunchy. And the other one's a j -j 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 javelin. With both you and Varric playing Farming Simulator, it keeps coming up on my recommend list on Steam now. <laughs> it's, it's not bad. Don't knock it till you try it, Naman. You haven't lived until you've taken a combine harvester through a, a field of wheat. Watch the, watch the thing behind you slowly fill up with the goods. It is, isn't it? It's almost as good as collecting rivets, bro. No, he missed the 1820, stupid bitch. You had one job. One job, Vixen, was to fuck up a commando with an AC-20 and you missed. Good to go. Now Otterhound's going to have to do the cleanup. Could go for a, a plate of gah. Yeah. And a cup of uh, Raktagino right now, huh? There's a lot more Star Trek fans here than I uh, Firing on target. What the fuck is with... Guys! You're making the you're making the Merc company look bad. Oh my giddy aunt. Oh shit. Oh, we gotta withdraw. Oh no. Um. Oh shisa. Oh. The, ooh. Um. Awaiting orders. Roger that. Oh ah. Uh. Okay. Um. Roger that. Yeah, I, you know what? I was just trying to be petty by blowing up one of their mechs, but the game's just never going to give me that. It's just going to, it's just going to slap me sideways. Seven mechs and I've been pincered from both sides. That's nasty. Uh, yeah, um, yeah. Withdraw. Fuck that noise. The command. <laughs> I'm not sticking around to get my ass kicked for that. Hey, it's on for eight hours a day, even every other day here on BBC Murica. I'm fucking out. It's on right now. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I don't care. I don't. I just, whew, no. Kirk was my spirit guide when I was growing up, could explain some things. What, your attraction to uh, to green women and the fact that every time you see a lizard you want to have a, f a fist fight with it? And that you make every word its own sentence? Alright. That that planet was uh, a dud. We, 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 can, we can safely say that planet 
was a bit of shitter. Uh, so we can go to Rock Wellowan. Uh, so we can go to Rock Wellowan, and then no, apparently we can't go to Cormadir from there. Uh, Itrim is not a good place to visit. Pantsir is pathetically easy. Tier 1. Aquaculture, Arid World, Dense Cloud Layer, High Gravity. What the fuck is the difference of Dense Cloud Layer? Okay, so I guess you'll be on mountainous maps for that one. Moderate population and peri uh, periphery level civilization, and it's a water world, but it's also arid. What? It's an arid water world? Ryan's fate. Fjelda. Bring them. Or bring them, sorry. Was it brute? Oh, God, did I read that properly? Yeah, bring them. Okay. Guldra. Gangtok. Heliat. Goromidir. Oh, Itrum. I mean, Itrum's, Itrum's probably good for money. Uh, good for getting some mech parts and stuff, but. Uh, what was the filter? Wrong filter. Okay, so within that section of space, we have a mere three worlds of that. Lao have four. Davina got zero two school <laughs> systems. Okay. And two and a half. Plenty of two and a half knocking around. Not bad for that. You know what? Okay, we'll go. We'll go to Guldra. It's gonna take. It's gonna take a month. Roger that, Commander. We'll see what we can Post get there. Spotted. It's filled with dehydrated water. <laughs> what do you think about the Halloween mask? Mighty Cole's just being punished because I'm awesome. The Mighty Boosh. Did they play that over on BBC America? I can't remember when I started the stream now. I think it was about quarter to ten. I think. Oh well. Was it? I bump into safety in the corridor. Let's throw a party! Woo! Safety to the hype spirits. Woo! Oh, they play an adult swim. Oh, okay. Mighty Boosh is weird. Went to a center and took a shit on a swap in. So Richard Ayoade, I think, got his uh, his start in Mighty Boosh. Obviously, I think he's probably best known for IT Crowd. But uh, for me and the bro, um, Richard Ayoade got his. Uh, for us, was, we first saw him in uh, Garth Marenghi's Dark Place. He was playing a character called Dean Lerner. And um, they also did a spin off series called Man to Man with Dean Lerner, which was just absolutely amazing. Glorious stuff. Garth Marenghi's Dark Place is great. There's like part, bits of banshees knocking about. Only two though. You see, they took they taught you. Even if you grounded, and you you said, oh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna get myself a fucking banshee. Set myself up. Get myself two banshee part. Ah, oh, no, there's only two banshee parts. No, you know. Then after three, there, you know, give you something to work toward. Dark place was amazing. I wish they did. They'd made a second series of dark place. I think I blame Channel Four. I think they put it on at a, a bad time slot. Not many people saw it. It just had it was such a uh, a great send up of that kind of awful, um, <laughs> awful like fucking sci-fi horror stuff, like Stephen King, the novels and that. Capture base. 
battle in an urban center, assassinate somebody in the polar regions. And I don't mean like, you know, <laughs> like in a frosty rectum or something. There we go. Uh, let's go in an urban fight. Woo! Against the Turians. We're going to swap out the Blackjack for a Centurion. It's got LRMs and uh, doesn't overheat as quickly. It's got more armor and it's, it's like five ton heavier. Oh, you saw a guy in MWO called Clem Fandango. That's awesome. Oh, do we have Little Green Armor? Oh, you mean for Rising Storm 2? Yeah, yeah. Uh, Vietnam 2. Yeah, we've, we've got... Uh, that, I think that's... The, the base version of it is free. But I think you can also buy extra maps and something. Can't remember. Yes, Master, we know you dislike Matt Berry because for some reason you don't find him funny. I <laughs> bring you this gift of a short press, yeah, in the, in the episode with the, the scotch mess, that's right. If you get hit by it, you get like a big orange beard and you have to wear a, 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 a tam o' and a fucking kilt. <laughs> he was on my team and I nailed it. Yes, I can hear you, Clem Fandango. Oh, man, yeah. That's, um... Oh, what the fuck? What? Toast of London, that's it, yeah, Steve Toast, yeah. <laughs> Masters were a fan of Mary Ferry now. Now he's 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 a sad he's a sad get Naman, don't worry. He's more a fan of Dallas than anything else. Don't worry, uh, Naman, we know him in real life. Command interface initiated. Whoa, this is like fucking crazy colours there in the city. Nighttime. Stand up fight. Now, Darius, she says give a stand up fight. Am I gonna get bushwhacked? Ready for action. Because I'm getting a feeling I'm going to get bushwhacked. Like, oh yeah, Commander, uh, those are uh, enemy reinforcements. Uh, like, well, thanks, thanks for that, Darius. Thanks for that. And uh, you know, while you're right here, yeah, hold this, uh, hold this pencil. No problem, boss. Just put I it, just move. put it between your your middle finger and your and your, and your ring finger. Got there. An okay. on now just, just push that, just push those fingers together against that pencil really hard for me for about an hour. Okay, could you do that for me, Darius? Yeah. Because if you could do that for me, that'd be grand, okay? You fucking test. On the move. Anyway. <laughs> that was the bro's reaction to paint 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 your whacking. What's up, boss? That that was that was him. Fucking if Freaking out over it. Paint your wagon! Paint your wagon! Oh, man, he went off his fucking nut. It was great. That was before Red Dead 2 came out. Still haven't completed that game. I need, I need to. I need to play that a lot more. Oh, Stanny Bye. Oh, yeah. On my way. Hello, bro. Oh, thank you, Vip Bro. Put fucking hairs on your legs. That was the AC 10. Four of my 10 element. That, that's a shit roll. That is a shitty roll. Oh god. I mean, I may as well. I may, the Hunchback is built to just brawl, so we may as well get it. David Hasselhoff greater than Richard Dean Anderson greater than all. My response to this is I will just continue to put the toffee crisps into the bag. No information. No information on the subject. Vindicator. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. At least it was on the left side. Damage minimal. Awaiting orders. Affirmative. Ooh. Looks like a CD's open at least. So we've got a javelin, a vindicator, and an enforcer. So far, the most dangerous thing of that is going to be the, it's going to be the, uh, the enforcer, and then it'd be the the uh, the Vindy Indy. So, it's the worst thing we got to look look out for. Okay. Right. 
We'll, uh, we'll use the mechanics of the game against it. Standing her behind a building. What line of sight? But because friendly has got line of sight, for some reason she can shoot through the building. Reasons. The chocolate chew. All that chocolate and all that chew. It's right for you, the reason chocolate chew. Is that actually a thing in America? Or was that just made up over here? Because that, that was the advert. That was the jingle that went with it. Ah, fuck you, for some reason the impulse can still see me. I don't know how this works. Ready for orders. Do, 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 do. Who was Seven of Nine's Borg father? Well, his name was Ernest. Ernest Borg Nine. Oh my god, gee. Wow, Unicorn Wallace, come on. Quack. Uh, Chris Scott, did you see Netflix Witcher uh, based on well, not games, but books? I seen the trailer, yeah. Um, it was a little bit underwhelming. It was a bit underwhelming. Uh, there wasn't a lot in it that really sort of, I don't know, made me want to watch it. But uh, I'll give it, I'll give it a fair shake when it's uh, when it's out. Move order received. But uh, just going by first Im impressions uh, wasn't the best, no. Alright, LRM for you and everything else on these. Really, really hoping for that kill. Hmm, went into the structure on the jungle. Oh, well. Target's taking a critical hit. <laughs> I just bogged that fuck's sake. Uh, oh no, ow, 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 Bender. Jesus. I'm wounded. Yeah, we, yeah, we know what to have. We know you, you're wounded. Love the way the hunchback rotate on the spot. Walk forward two paces. Stop in tree line. You have reached your destination. Miss with AC-20, but hit with lasers. You negligent monster. Nice. Come on, dickhead. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, that chocolate, oh, well, that chew. Firing jump jet. A C plus shows me. I don't know, I can't rate it yet, Alan Grossman, until I've actually seen it. Confirm. Oh, it's nice that something like The Witcher gets Critical a TV series, commander. though. That's it's nice, that's cool. Because The Witcher games were, were good, uh, and I know the books were pretty popular. Not read any of them, point that out. I'm aware that the games do deviate uh, considerably from the books. And I know that the uh, author isn't exactly the biggest Taking fan the of the game, though he was happy to take their money, but then criticise them straight after. Typical. That's gonna hurt. Ready for orders. Typical author bullshit where they uh, the, like, oh yeah, fine, sir, I don't care, whatever. Oh, it's become really popular. I want a bigger cut. I'm like yeah, whatever, mate. On it. I wonder if that javelin is going to die. Uh, so yeah, take that joke and spread it. Spread it far and wide. It will trigger the Hypnotic Order 66 all Star Trek fans have been programmed with after watching years of Trek. They will now try to get laid all at once. Do we want Do we want all like a lot of horny Star Trek fans running around though? I mean, is, is, that, is that the risk we're willing to take? No, is that just too much? What is that? Oh, it's a Centurion. Oh, it's it's the AL version. Oh, that's not good. Try it, headshot. I'm not sure what I hit with the AC-20. What I hit? Oh, apparently, I popped his CT like a great. Standing by. 
Engaging target. Eh, uh, that's alright, I guess. What's up, boss? You know, could be better see me. Sorry, I mean, you think Netflix is Witcher show, maybe sequels, uh, sequels show, like, it's okay. Look, uh, as I said, I don't know. No, the lights go to lots of like beats you up. <laughs> yes, Commander. We can't risk that kind of impact. I copy. Oh, I want to do over it. Oh, Locking on target. All right, LRMs. LRMs through the building, then. Let's fucking do it. Where's the Centurion going? Who's he gonna shoot? He's probably gonna shoot the punchback. Ow. Ow. Ow, 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 Jean-Michel Jarre of pain. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, 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 ow. Fucking shot me. Do, do, do. Fuck. Jeez. Do. Fucking user interface. They have pent up fluids that need release. It isn't like Pom Far for fucking Star Trek fans. Stop it. Wrong. All but committed. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. do, do, do. Bow. 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 Locking in all weapons. So what's everyone's uh Forward what's everyone's view on the old uh MacQuarrie five thing? Aye, aye. Everyone here think about it. So everyone stay calm about that. I certainly did. Receiving you. The bro might still get a cop. If you didn't hear him shot, he may still buy a cop. What's everyone's view? On what? A lying snake told us one thing and then completely reversed and told us a different thing. What does everyone think about that? Hey! What's everyone think? I like waiting another 15 months so I can get a stable game. Okay, Papa. Yeah, fair enough. Aye, aye. Acknowledge. It's dead. Target neutralized. Would I be talking about Ross? I don't know, Master. Am I Mission talking about Ross? I mean, I'm just talking about someone who tells you one thing and then basically lies out of their back packet, uh, back passage afterwards, you know, and tells you a completely different thing. That that could cover a lot of people, you know? Not just not just Russ. Holy shit, the Centurion was on fire, got three of the four kills, and Griffin got one. The hunchback, which took a lot of damage, got no kills. But should get nominal man of the match. Oh wait a minute, whoa, what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm seeing some, I'm seeing a plus here for the LRM5. We could take a Plus two stability damage to LRM5. Oh, what's the opportunities? I'm used to lies, used to work for the government. <laughs> I'm talking about uh, Boss Rollock. Yeah, that's it. I was talking about Boss Rollock. He's, uh. Works for that other company making that other free to play game who, uh. who <laughs> lied. But of course, to some. Oh, you can't call them a liar, because they're not lying. I think the Canadian Human Rights Council needs to hear about my human feelings being hurt and I need money to make me feel better. I hear Russ just got a bunch and I feel that would make it, me feel very good. Well, I mean, the, you know, it sounds like they're going to be quite generous with some of these refunds. Although, that said, on a serious note, um, Furnica uh, has still been waiting to get his refund. Um, and he hasn't heard anything back since. And he's been trying to contact them, I think, every day. Oh, okay, so different element. 
plus plus LRM5. Haha. Tradesies. No, not two. There we go. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. How long is how long is he out for? Fifteen days. Fifteen days. A defend base mission that's worth a million. Yeah, we might we might have to try this, but we may have we may have to wait the fifteen days just to get Job's the done, old Botter Hound back in. Methinks. Gonna need our best shooters on this one. Standing by. Mail sort of greater, so she's got 22.5 bonus. I'm your spaniel. Fuck off, herringbone. Waiting for orders. Max sprints, let's see. Plus two health. Indirect fire penalty. Uh, I mean, he can sprint a bit quicker, but if we're going to do a base defense for ourselves, it's not really going to count for much in this particular complete. case. Standing by. Uh. Yeah, it's, good. it's basically Trading everyone's just going to get gunnery upgrades, except for my character, who will just get an extra. Confirmed, Commander. There we go. Right. Let's try this. It's worth a mil. Your bitch, what's my money, bitch? It's basically that. I want to stream it, so I'm keeping my order to see how it is. Yeah, fair enough. You know, I'm under no illusion that the game will be terrible by any stretch. I think the game will probably be fun. Also, one is copy free, so they didn't pay anything. So, well, more more reason to, because if you got your copy for free, it doesn't matter because nobody, you haven't, you're not out of pocket. You're not having to wait for a refund. You can try it out, and if you've got no qualms about using the Epic Launcher, that's fine, isn't it? That's that's the main thing. What, if someone bought me a copy? That, well, yeah, because then you wouldn't have paid for it, but I'm just wondering, would you play it after the fact that you did a video? I, I, don't, I don't think I could make videos after the fact, no. After that main one, which is unfortunately one of my most popular videos for all the wrong reasons. It should be popular because I was ec ecstatic and jubilant about some great news about Me MechWarrior Battletech. Instead, it was absolute abject fucking vitriol. Um... I don't think I could make gameplay videos for MechWarrior 5, even if someone bought me a copy. Yeah. I don't think I could, because I think it would be, you'd just be a hypocrite, unfortunately, yeah. so. Oh, you, you want a free copy as well, Papa? Oh, that's not too bad. I can Discord backseat pilot when you play. <laughs> you can't hear the bro. Well, that's right, that's right. Well, he's at the other side of the room, Master. I'm, I'm micing him up. He's coming over to say what he just said, so so everyone can hear it. I said if someone had bought him a copy, would he have played it? And he said he wouldn't because he feels that because of what happened with the video he made and how, you know, angry he was. Because literally he found out and then made a video rather than giving it 20 minutes or whatever. Yeah. I don't know whether you jumped the gun on that. I mean, it's difficult to say. I know you were angry, and and you weren't the only one, so... Yeah. Um... It's, it's just it's just a shit situation, really. But I can see how you feel that you look like a two-faced... Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. If yeah. you then... Oh, well, I didn't pay for it, someone bought me this, so I'm gonna stream it, so... I just think it's unfortunate, because people probably would have enjoyed watching you play it. I did enjoy the life footage Command from the AMA. <laughs> that's what I said. Yeah, so that's what the bro said in case anyone was uh, just wanted to be sure on that one. Oh good, they set up ba uh, turrets around the base. The old, this old chestnut. But we've got to make sure that these Two guys, these guys in, in these cars over here make it over alive. Alright, okay, we can do this, guys. Put the hunchback in the water. 
Oh, I can have a bar. Prepping for jump. I've actually enjoyed this weekend. Went full on silly in the Macrofive Discord. Pulled my finger out my ass and started to write a short story. <laughs> okay, my God. I wait for all the lovely microtransactions. <laughs> they could come. Yeah, they, they could. I don't know. I think what they'll probably do is um, DLC packs, to be honest. I think they'll do several smaller DLC packs as they go along. Uh, sorry, what's the enemy? Oh, we've got vehicles. We've got mechs. We've got vehicles, we've got mechs, we've got everything you need. Ready to get it on. Alright, let's find out what this is. It was moving quite quick, so I suspect it's a light mech. Oh no, it's a medium, it's a cicada. It's Sally Wan's favourite. He swears by those bleeding things. Oh, it's Blackjack. Oh, I thought he was going to light up the uh, the APC there. Then. Right, so the Hunchback is in the worst possible place. Admit it, you want to see an Atlas doing the flops. <laughs> By the way, Vixen pronounced in German is jerking off. You don't have to let me know that, Papa. I knew I knew beforehand. Aye aye. Oh yeah, don't worry. Engaging jump jet. Loot boxes, TLCs, five of them, one every two months of microtransactions out the ass. Uh waiting for orders. I don't think Unky Russ could actually do that. I don't think he he has um, enough ideas, enough fresh ideas to, to come up with stuff that they could make his DLC. I mean, look, that that's the shit they could have done with fucking Mech Warrior uh, online, and they never did. Target acquired. Oh no! An explosion warning. I blow up this coolant e exchanger. I could do this all day. Did actually do any damage to that, uh, to that point, Jack? Apparently I gave him a heat spike. Not about it. Just keep an eye out for the way Epic Games gives gives away. You may get one for free anyway. <laughs> that would that would be a real piss of fun, wouldn't it? Although I did like the fact that the news yeah, yesterday said that uh, Phoenix Point had been delayed till December, so Russ's plan of having a, a sort of completely empty month of releases is already out of the water. Uh, because one of the big games this year will now be on Epic around about the same time. Orders. So there's always that hilarity to look forward to. As, if more games get delayed. Look at those look at those artifacts and shadows. Woo! They are just having a good old time. Got virtually no armor. Nobody loves you. The games are raged on. They just broke up for DLCs. No idea. Palladium Max or Platinum. Those go with Platinum Max. Get your new Platinum Mac Pack. Only $500. Awaiting orders. They'll never escape that one, will they? The, the spectre of the, uh, of the gold Mac. Haunting shadow of the uh, bad business decisions. Uh, for, they'll do like um, they'll do a clan invasion DLC, but I still think the clans will be in the base game anyway. I think when you hit the end of the time limit, thirty forty nine, I think if you take missions in the sort of periphery area near like Kiriton and Steiner and Razalhag space, I think you'll eventually come across um, a, like clan attacks. I, I think it'll be rare. And I think it'll be a big thing at first. People go, oh my god, I've encountered clans. Oh wow, did you confirm they're in the game? And then people just start like getting clans out. And that'll be like an end game to go for. But I still think they'll do uh, an, an invasion expansion pack, uh, probably like summer 2020. Oh, 
update the tech base, maybe add in a few new uh, Insphere mechs. Obviously, all of the original clan invasion mechs, and then they can DLC the crap out of that with, you know, clan mech pack, you know, clan re uh, reinforcement pack, Steel Viper has arrived, Nova Cat's arrived, Diamond Shark's arrived, Intersphere reinforcement pack, you know, upgrade your arsenal with, uh, with you know, these eight new Intersphere designs. People ask for the Axe Man, no Melly Combat. We're not doing it. The little cicada that could. Is he going for, He's going to go for the machine gun. No, he didn't. He just crept forward. Manticore tank. Oh, that's worrying. Don't like Manticore tanks. You've got hostile contacts inbound. Oh, I know we've got hostile contacts inbound. I was hoping the LRM5 might have just been enough to tip them over, uh, over, kill him permanently. Oh no, he's, uh, he's still dragging his leg. Dragging his fucking leg. I barely hit, Commander. Machine gun in my fucking... My Centurion? What's all this about? Oh no! Oh, the camera fucked me at the last second there. Wow. Thanks, game. Thanks for that. Jesus. You bought the game, no spend more. Well, of course you do. That's, that's games today anyway, isn't it? It's all, it's all just... Yes, Commander. You know, get, get the most out of your game by buying Firing everything else target. that we've yet to release. The only games where you can realistically get away with regular content updates that require you to pay for extra stuff is free-to-play games, because that's the market that they run on. That's the system. If they're asking you to drop, like, $60 or £50 or whatever it is that, that they're asking on, on the store, you should just get, I don't know, the whole thing. And DLCs, if they are going to do them, need to be Confirm. much more significant. No, Blackjack, I don't think you should be on that building. That building's gone. Oh, reinforcements coming from that, sir. A little bit of leg damage. <laughs> you want to play Windowed Borderless? <laughs> it's the DLC for you. There we go, finally got the turrets online. And now the APCs will drive off and sacrifice themselves in glorious combat. Because they always do. Manticore driver's drunk, and he's driving the tank backwards and hasn't quite made a decision. Oh, he's going to fire at the APC. Whiffed by the turret there, a couple of PVC blasts. I'm interested to see, actually, will the blackjack engage me? Because I shot the building. AI to attack me now. Oh. We saw the top of that building, but the, the APC got, got deaded. Uh, yes, Metal Gear 5, um, you had to pay for save slots, yeah. Well, I mean, their argument is you don't have to pay for save slots. Standing by. I mean, that's entirely your choice if you want to pay for them. Yeah, you know, they want to be super serial about it. Giving them everything I've got. Well, that's Konami. Konami at all. There's a company that's lost any and all sort of perspective on uh, what they were originally set up to do. Commander. Enemy outflanked, bringing the pain. The enemy outflanked, but apparently you can't hit the CTL. Oh, of course, there's ammo to explode. Tango down. Hey, ammo explosion. Got the blackjack. Nice. <laughs> you can see because you can see because you can see because you can 
Oh, I've got all, no, all the city storage. Oh, those are all those boxes of the Street Fighter miniatures game I've been waiting for. You just stepped on them. Destroyed every last copy. Locking in all okay, well, so it's a bit of a neck fell. Reminds me of the Doctor Who episode with the spacesuits where you need to pay for the oxygen. Oh, yeah. Ah, back when Doctor Who was good. And then they got writers in who apparently don't like Doctor Who with an actress who has never watched Doctor Who. It's, it's, I, I think that's always the best way of approaching, you know, making a, a series in a long-running popular sci-fi uh, show, you know. Get people who have absolutely no clue what it is they're doing. It's guaranteed success, right? Yeah, the save slots were five bucks each, that's right. Where's that manticore? There it is. Drove behind a building. Can the turrets do any better? Well, we're going to find out. Or not, as the case would seem, as I believe there's another vehicle that the enemy lance has got. Now, turrets have generally been pretty good for me in the past. Uh, at least at least one of the PPCs hit, you know, we're getting somewhere. Plus 15 resolve as we work away. They've got two hunchback full Gs. Uh, no! Fuck! No, oh, these these guys are pissed. Taking heavy hits, Commander. Uh, they just they just want me instead. Oh, this isn't good. Yes, Commander. Acknowledged. Oh, get off the, get off that rooftop. Do not want to go dancing with, uh, with the hunchback in the pale moonlight. Don't want to do that. Got the angle. Take the shot. Okay. Critical hit, commander. It was a critical hit, but it wasn't really anything significant, was it? Oh, it was a party back. Fuck off. Alright, Unica Wallace. <laughs> Have a good one, man. Alright, it's AC5 crit, left torso destroyed, left arms destroyed. It's SRM2 crit. He's on fire. Heal. He's all out of Another Shadow Hawk. Oh, a head hit. Commander, I'm a hit. Yeah, because those aren't way too regular. Aye, aye. Affirmative. It's not like it gets old seeing head hits every bleeding second now. Oh, do they hit you with missiles? Ah, oh, it's de definitely head hit. I wish I, would, I got that many headshots shots on the tabletop. Oh, uh, fire missiles. Head hit. Yay. Smoked one. What's up, boss? Understood. Oh, we'll I have to get these two out of the way because they don't have jump jets, so I have to just hop around and avoid that. Get them behind this building. Also, she can cool down. Oh, it's the it's the APC. <laughs> Scratch that arm armor. Still got the man to go. Oh, oh no! I think this is the end of the slide now. Oh, oh shit, that front armor. Oof, significant hit by the PPC blew off his arm. These pirates are bringing it all. He's got a lot of missiles. What an LRM is that? Might be an LRM carry. Oof, another two uh, PPC shots there from that turret. I think all the turrets are PPCs. Alright, party back. Where's he gonna go? Who's this 
target. Jump to the turret. Ooh, just shy of killing that turret in one shot. Oh, get rid of that fucker. Hot damn. Let's do this. Enemy For it, since how many people split again? I think it's still got a okay player base at the moment. I think people just want to play Fallout. Ow. Wow, what a bitch. He just walked up, shot my hunchback with his hunchback. Standing by. Copy that. Reet. Okay. Well, I don't like that right torso. Taking the shot. I want to remove it. More than MWO? Yeah, definitely more than MWO. There's, there's no. Ready for orders. No, Chris. Considering MWO's player base at the moment is uh, hovering around 500 on average every day now. It's quite small. Here it comes. Did I get a sight on that one? Was it, was it just his arm? Ah, oh, I got sight on Okay, so his AC5's gone. That's good. Standing by. Uh, I'm just going to have to sprint. Double time. Let's go. I have to use the roads. Oh, a head hit again? Off a fucking ace, uh, SRM2 and LRM5, really? Jesus Christ, game. Oh, it was an LRM carrier as well. Oh, I thought it was going to dump all its missiles into my own side. There's so many LRMs. Turret's revenge, though. How do you get playing on on Steam? If you click the Community Hub uh, button on Steam for any game uh, that has an online component, anyway. Uh, although for some single player, it doesn't always work the first time. If you keep refreshing it, it will eventually show uh, player numbers uh, currently online in game at that point in time. Warning: armor breached. Internal damage. Oh, fuck yeah! I'll just walk around this side of this building, bitch. Probably that bastard is going to shoot me now, but I guess at least it breaks. Oh no, he's going for the turret again. Waiting for orders. On my way. Uh, at least I can use the LRM now. Oh, SteamChart.com as well. Yeah, will also give you a, a. You can get a sort of baseline average of uh, how many players are online. That's fine, that turret never shot anyone anyway. Someone just sits there, just did nothing. Yes, Commander. Everything I've got. That's a kill. 
I imagine the recovery operation when we get that mech order. off the top of that building. Roger. Yeah, a lot of work. Roger. It's the wrong side of the mech, but yeah, it's damage is damage, isn't it? Well, that went until. Where's he going to go? Is he going to take cover? Is he going to shoot one of my guys? Just running for his life? Just running for his life? Cooling off, really. Standing by. Oh, the frame rate drops in urban maps are pretty bad. We really need to fix these, to be honest. This optimization pass would be nice. Just shove it off the roof. <laughs> Yeah, I should get a dropship to you know, winch it, yeah. Uh, which was the... Yeah, no, there's that one, there's that one. Overheat! Oh. No, we'll go with it since we've got some ammo left. Firing at enemies. I should have targeted the left also, we would have shot the right one. Reporting critical hit. Oh, actually going for the objective. The first time any of the buildings have been hit. Orders. Uh, Locking in all weapons. It's all that important side of his mech as well. Let's face it, I, I can stand to lose Vixen if it's like a bad thing, because Vixen can't die. His right torso is gone, so pretty much 90% of his weapons are out of the fight. Enemy mech, critical damage detected. I'm ready for orders. Stompy, stompy, stomp with the Centurion. Firing. I don't think any of the turks get shot. Oh, that one has a brown. Okie dokie. Let's say no to the next round of firing. Ah, uh, is, is he gonna go back and shoot? No, no, he's heading down the street. I thought he was gonna go around and shoot my hunchback. Oh, nope, he's gonna shoot the griffin. Oh, he missed. Luckily. Damage. Yeah, All right, bro. Sneezing your head off there. To Over position. in the background. Just trying to stifle it. Every time you sneeze, an angel gets its wings. But straight shot. And <laughs> I knocked him down with a straight shot. That's awesome. Boom. <laughs> that was ace. Oh, the straight shot's funny. <laughs> Watch games, such wow. Ah, wrong torso. Black on AC-10 ammo. Squanch. Commander. Uh oh, all right. Crystal fire, Roger. Name shot CT. Enemy down. Got this guy with maybe a medium laser and a small. Yep, I 
close by. <laughs> Light damage, holding firm. Well, the turret did not get the killing blow. Well, that's it. The base is secure, so the pirate, pirate will get killed by the reinforcements that are going in. <laughs> that was quite fun. That was a good mission, that. It's always nice on base defense missions because the AI generally don't target you anyway. Then you can just pick on one mech at a time and on one vehicle. Ah, big payout. Wow, 833,000 payout. Alright, a couple of pilot injuries, unfortunately, due to bullshit missile mechanics, but... Uh, spare blackjack we can sell. Oh, finally a Shadowhawk. 2H, that's good. And... I don't think there's any... Lost gear in the lot. No, it's not ammo and stuff like that. So a blackjack that we can sell for some extra sea bills. We'll keep the Shadowhawk so we can upgrade one of our mechs. Go up a bit more in the old tonnage. What time are we on? Oh, might have to uh, might have to end it there. I think to get this stuff sorted. So, uh, let everyone know uh, tomorrow. Me and Davros, at least. I don't know if Goober's joining us. Um, we will try and do Metcor online. We're not sure uh, how easy that's going to be. We're not going to try and drop in quick play because uh, I think it, at this point it's been proven that uh, two-man drop teams don't work uh, at all. Uh, not not a uh, shadow of a, of a doubt. That no! Fuck it. Oh, phew, no. I thought I just sold the wrong mech. Oh, phew. No, I didn't. I just sold the other thing. There we go. So, we're going to try and do a faction drop, but if we don't get a match in, like, quarter of an hour, we're just going to roll it over to lobbies and see how many people we get. And um, we'll just do some lobby madness uh, for uh, an hour and a bit. That's going to be Friday's stream. Outside of that, I'm going to be recording Riflemans for the Chassis series. Three of them uh, to do, so that should be fun. And then uh, I'm also going to get a Law Warrior done. I think I'm going to stick with the Unseen, so Law Warrior for the Crusader. I think is uh, on the uh, on the cards, and as something else. Oh yeah, yeah. There's a there's a video uh, for another game. I won't I won't spoil it. Uh, that me and me and the bro played. We're gonna get that on the channel today, hopefully. So yeah, that's how uh, that's how it's looking. Let's get that sorted. I'll let you know when that's right. Okay. Um, not braining properly. There we go. Uh, so, thank you to everybody who joined me this morning. Glenn Unicorn Walsh, but Adam Grayson, Angel of Flight, uh, Canuck Roughneck, uh, Cycle Motion, Kirov99, Lurks, uh, Major Kektia, Master15616, Miss Ikari, Naman, Omega Tech Consolidated, Pincer of Fate, Skinny Seahorse, Slowcool, Tade, the Mighty Kulsh, VNK Vigafrost, and Von Grunk. Thank you all for joining me this morning. Hope you all have a good weekend coming up starting tomorrow. Hope it isn't too hot for you all. And, uh, yeah, uh, if you can join us on Friday, please do. If nothing else, we can just be there for the chat. And, uh, yeah, until then, have a good one all. Thanks again. Bye. Bye. Bye.